This conviction is something, but it's not everything. We, the jury, find the defendant, Jason Van Dyke, guilty of second degree murder. We, the jury, find the defendant, Jason Van Dyke, guilty of aggravated battery with a firearm, first shot. We, the jury, find the defendant, Jason Van Dyke, guilty of aggravated battery with a firearm, second shot. We, the jury, find the defendant, Jason Van Dyke, guilty of aggravated battery with a firearm, third shot. We, the jury, find the defendant, Jason Van Dyke, guilty of aggravated battery with a firearm, fourth shot, fifth shot, sixth shot, seventh shot, eighth shot, ninth shot, tenth shot, eleventh shot, twelfth shot, thirteenth shot, fourteenth shot, fifteenth shot. We, the jury, find the defendant, Jason Van Dyke, guilty of aggravated battery with a firearm, sixteenth shot. The 16 counts were for every bullet that Van Dyke fired at Laquan McDonald. Very significant that the number 16 is used because it means that the jury, the jury understands and agrees that every shot that left the gun of Van Dyke was unnecessary. Not only was the taking of his life, but every decision that he made to pull the trigger was unnecessary. I'm glad this is the verdict that we received today, but I want to be clear. We should not be receiving a verdict today to be glad about. Laquan McDonald did not pose a serious threat to this officer. And the reason why I know he didn't pose a serious threat to this officer is because the officer had to lie in order to try to justify his actions. Jason Van Dyke got off lucky. He could have been found guilty of first degree murder, which would mean he would never ever see light of day ever again. Second degree murder means they believe that, maybe he believed that his life was in jeopardy, though he acted unreasonable and unnecessary. Jason Van Dyke is only the first police officer in 50 years from Chicago to be convicted of murder while on duty. There was a lot of protests surrounding this event in Chicago. Chief of police was fired. In my estimation, it didn't go far enough. Rahm Emanuel should have been fired. Jason Van Dyke not only lied on his police reports, but other police officers signed off on his lie. He said he tried to back away from Laquan McDonald. That looked like backing away to you? He said that Laquan McDonald lunged at him. Do you see a lunge? This is not just about Jason Van Dyke. This is about the officers that signed off. This is about a mayor's office who didn't want this story to come out until after a re-election. It's about death and murder that took place. With people who were sworn to protect who did the opposite. Don't get me wrong, I'm happy that we got this conviction, ladies and gentlemen. This conviction is something, but it's not everything. We, the jury, find the defendant, Jason Van Dyke, guilty of second degree murder. We, the jury, find the defendant, Jason Van Dyke, guilty of aggravated battery. Subscribe to this channel.